Hey everybody, welcome back to Police Quest. We're gonna go see Judge Simpson in her chambre. In her chambre. We're gonna show her our extremely disappointing penis. <laughs> Judge Simpson looks up at you as you come into her chambers. Watch the last episode to understand why we're showing her our penis. Yeah, it's not, it's not something we want to do. I see you back. Did you have a problem with the warrant? No, not the warrant. It's just gaining entry. Fucking place is fortified, man. There's like only one way to get into that house. So what I'm doing, okay, what I'm doing is requesting a special order to use the department's... Oh. I didn't want to use this word, but I'm going to have to use this word. Ram unit. If you know what I mean. Well, I'm going to have to see your ram unit then, Bonds. <laughs> <laughs> the judge studies you closely and then says... Mm. All right, officer, I trust your judgment. Show me your ram unit. <laughs> doot, doot, doot. Now, will you, now you just... Just lean over and trust my judgment. <laughs> now go ahead, take that shit, get out of here. You basic, the get the fuck out. Dishel. You basic. <laughs> Wait, did you call me basic? <laughs> did I? I don't know, did I? I literally can't remember. Oh, God, shoot the judge. She'd rip you <laughs> apart, but <laughs> You're goddamn right she would. Oh, oh, here She's she a comes. werewolf, Bonds. She's a werewolf. Watch out, boy. She'll chew you up. Whoa, Whoa here, here she comes. comes. She's, She's a man eater. eater. You got it. You got it. Yeah. We sang that in uh, yesterday's episode of uh, of Stardew Valley. We did. Well, Thursdays, I guess, technically. But this actually makes sense. Friday. Yeah, no, it's it makes more sense at the very least. <laughs> it didn't make sense there. Now it does. Morales says... You trying to rack up points for pedestrians or what, Bonds? Um, Morales, uh, I've been meaning to talk to you for some time, but I really... And I and I mean this. I really <laughs> need you to shut the fuck up. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> Someday, eh, Sonny? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I, I can only hope. If you want me to drive, just holler. Yeah, there's no way for the game to do that. I wish you could drive. Did you see that gorgeous hunk of man back there? What the fuck is up with her? <laughs> Why is... God. Oh, I, th I think I think her nostrils might be a little white. <laughs> oh, I know. That's right. She needed to pass the time while we were in with the judge. <laughs> is, uh, is that a milk, milk mustache, Morales? <laughs> None of your business, fucko. I'll rip your <laughs> <Fucko>. head off. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, everything's man. cool, man. Just get to the goddamn crack house, okay? I've got a plan. It's gonna be fucking awesome. <laughs> Have you ever seen that one video with the spider that just covers himself in powder? <laughs> I'm gonna do that. <laughs> I'm gonna rip these fuckers apart with my teeth. It's gonna be great. <laughs> I have to hold the mouse steady. Bunts. Okay. Bunts. What the fuck are we doing? Put on your siren, asshole. We're gonna make this legit. <laughs> Come on, do it. Bonds? Bond the Bonds? portable red light on the Are you dash. my dad? Can I call you my dad? <laughs> Bunts. At five miles an hour. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to pretend to be my Uncle Luis. Scream out the window about Nam. Do it now. <laughs> Just keep yelling for Charlie. It's like my childhood all over again. Do it. <laughs> I uh okay I, I I will say nothing. Um, all right, all right, let's let's okay, stop. Bad place no, is the stop it. no. Okay, oh god, just turn off the. All right, all right, wait, just okay. I got it. Uh, uh, but gotta get out of the car. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks to Judge Simpson, the ram is in place and ready to go. Oh man. Oh, Morales, look at this. It's a real ram unit. I got your back, Sonny. Keep your head down. I'm going to fucking disappear now. <laughs> and the pentakiller. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
La Casa de Pentakiller. <laughs> oh, wow, you know, guys, I've never really seen a ram unit before up close. This thing is pretty great. The ram is a fortified military vehicle that's been converted for police work and fitted with a steel hydraulic boom. It can get through it just about anything, at any time, anywhere, anyhow. Your backup officer is in position. He has no name, so don't don't get too attached to him. Just uh, give the boys uh, the word, Sarge, and uh, yeah. That was dialogue, so you know. Oh, it's Mario. I miss Delepsy. I know, right? Wait until I'm positioned. Then take out the door with me in front of it. <laughs> Shazam! Shazam! It's a shame you just didn't use your leg. <laughs> well, it is a giant steel door, so there is that. <laughs> <I love that. laughs> it was great. Okay. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> oh well. Hello again. Uh, next time you enter a suspect dwelling, make sure both you and your gun are ready. Well, I mean, that is sound advice. Uh, I, 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 I shit the bed. I screwed up. So is Just, he telling, uh, is he, give the word. is he giving us what? this advice from the afterlife? Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah. He's well, giving, uh, yeah, you weren't, uh, you didn't know it, but young Jim Walls is, uh, St. Peter. <laughs> yes. Yes, young British Jim Walls. <laughs> Wait until this yeah, ram it, ram it. <laughs> yeah, that was hot. I'm all <laughs> engorged now with my forgettable penis. Oh, hey, uh, one thing, guys. Die. Nice. <laughs> Ding. <laughs> Freeze, motherfucker. Don't shoot. I give up! <laughs> Our second suspect is surrendering. It takes you a moment to realize it. It's Michael Baheens! Don't you move an inch, buddy. Can I tell you to get on the ground? Don't move an inch! That's like... That was, was procedure before. Don't move an inch, buddy. You feel a sense of satisfaction as you slip the cuffs and the wrists of Michael Baines. Oh, hi! Michael Baines. This is, uh, Michael Baines, huh? I'll take it, uh, from here. Uh, Sonny. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, I love, I love dead bodies. I'm gonna go check this guy out. Ah, <laughs> I bet he's had... I'm gonna make a bet with myself. I bet he's handsome. Okay, I bet he's handsome. Let's go take a look. I didn't get a good look at him. Let's take a look. Oh, look at that poster of that girl. Wow. She's from December, if you remember correctly. And you do. Well, that was, uh, that was climactic. No, go, go look at that. Uh, well. <laughs> hey, uh, Sonny. I'm gonna let my dog eat the guy in there, okay? <laughs> Dispatch radio that you might need Spike here. He's got the scent of something big in there. He's about to pull my arm off if I don't let go. I'm pretty sure he's going to eat that dead guy. Go ahead, eat. <laughs> yeah, look at him. Look at him go. Look at him bound in. Officer Parks is with the K-9 unit. He's lonely. <laughs> I wonder what Spike's all upset about. And this is the. I went to talk to somebody and not advance the plot. I guess, uh, yeah. Spike looks agitated. He seems to have found something. I know, boy. It's a white sofa in this place. Can you believe it? The old couch <laughs> has a few cushions. This on it. couch with these walls. <laughs> Are you joking? Ugh. I'd be upset too, boy, if I could see. But <laughs> blight. <laughs> Spike prefers not to be petted while he's concentrating. Oh, so we didn't make an animation for that. You look underneath the filthy cushion and find a remote control. Good work, dog. Good. 
gently you place the remote control in your mouth and push until it's gone. <laughs> Smike looks ag- agitated. Smike. Smike. Nice. <laughs> Ooh. This is a bomb, clearly. Zero. Nope. What? Nope. Two. Two. Oh, it's the heart channel. It's I Love Lucy, probably. Probably. Nothing. These guys have a terrible cable plan. They're just the worst. I bet they only have Channel 2. It might, yeah. It's possible. I don't see the reason to buy such a large TV if you don't invest in other channels. Well, they got a white... What? (laughs) Ha ha! I cannot imagine how they set that one up. I mean, there must have just been like an additional uh, like infrared sensor or something like that in here. But anyway. That is... (sighs) Stupid! I love it. Oh, I'm just gonna save here. Thanks, Mike. Okay. Now oh, I am no. doing something wrong at this exact moment. This um, is this is the ghost of Jesse Baines in here. He's back. Hope you're ready to yeah. wrestle. The table is covered with various tools to make <laughs> drugs. Yep. For once, I varies. didn't fuck that up. <laughs> the tools are varies. The tools are varies. Oh boy, look at these barrels. I love them. Oh wow. The barrels contain chemicals to make drugs. You don't want to disturb the drugs. You don't want to disturb the drugs. Much. You take the drugs. I'm actually surprised that nothing has happened before. I've always thought there we go. Oh! Oh! Look at that this guy. guy. really should have, have killed me when I was standing around there, but... A good police officer is always prepared. You'll do better next time, no doubt. You have no choice. Why did you place your arrow over the top of my crotch? Never mind. <laughs> I know the answer. <laughs> Everybody knows the answer. Let's go. Let's move. Biddy, 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 uh, uh. Bitty, 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 uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Varies tools to make drugs. Varies tools. Ah, oh, that's what you were talking about. Last May- time. Maybe I'm gonna shoot the drugs. Who knows? Possible. <laughs> I'm a complicated man. And no one understands me but my woman. Except she's like my, she doesn't. Woman. She doesn't really understand anything these days. I'm gonna be <laughs> honest with you. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. oh, hey. <laughs> hey, you shot him. Hold on while I check his vital signs. Fuck's sake. This again. It yep. must be a Tuesday. Oh, oh, shit! Oh, no. I'd like to say it was fun, Bonds. But you've been a real pain in my ass, you male pig. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hi! I'm Detective Hooks, Internal Affairs. Why, we've been keeping an eye on her since your report. Lucky I was here. See ya! <laughs> <laughs> and off Congratulations. I go. <laughs> You've not only solved your murder case, but you've also found an incapacitated and dangerous cult that was processing crack. Now all that's left to fight is the paperwork. You're almost welcoming the routine of it all. There is such a thing as too much excitement. <laughs> Now, time to celebrate with some drugs. You gently place the crack in your mouth and push it until it's gone. Wouldn't it have been amazing, (laughs) though, if they made you finish the game doing paperwork? (laughs) But now, but for now, let the cleanup crew do their job, and the guilty sleep their dreamless sleep. For you, there's something that happens, but who knows what. I don't think I'll be able to look at you again without feeling what I feel right now. (laughs) Without remembering what a miracle it is to hold you. Uh, uh, (laughs) Speaking of miracles, Dr. Powers is just giving me a bit of news. Oh, Sonny. I'm all the way pregnant. (laughs) We're gonna have a baby. (laughs) I'm not half pregnant no more 
Arab baby? <laughs> LBD recently revived this top secret list of the names and occupations of the members in religious electronic terrorist group. The gang leader, one Jim Pretty Boy Walls, has been known to threaten shape Litton's future like so much silly putty. It's not known at this time if this gang's intentions are for good or evil, or if they should even be taken seriously. Nevertheless, be on the lookout for the following gang members. They're all wanted for christening. Ah, oh, nice, nice, good one, guys. Well done, Team Sierra. Well, that's uh, Police Quest 3. Now, I'd like to um, give a little bit of extra uh, context to the game while it goes through the uh, the credits. So, um, I kind of stopped talking about this partway through uh, even Police Quest 2, but I have read the novelizations of all of the Police Quest series. And obviously they've taken some liberties, but in the novelization, when you get to this sort of end point here, uh, Morales has a lot more of a monologue and kind of in a weird way, uh, a, a better motivation for sort of that last heel turn, despite the, uh, you know, aside from the whole, like, I'm a crack dealer, blah, blah, blah. Um, <laughs> I would know, hope when, so. Yeah, and 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 the weird like miss or or, or oddly paced uh, you know anti male sentiment shit at the end there right yeah that's weird um, yeah uh, I I don't I'm not quite sure about all of that but anyway so um, in the novel uh, it turns out that Pat Morales is actually the stepdaughter of Jesse Baines. Oh, shit. Whoa. <laughs> Super fucking contrived. Uh, yeah, and it turns out that she, like, she was um, she was raised by... She's the daughter of Michael Baines, basically, right? Um, and then uh, she... But Michael Baines, like, uh, she was... Or, or her, maybe her father was abusive or something like that. I don't remember all of it. It's been, like, a, uh, it's been a good number of months since I read the, the novel. Basically, like... Um, she was raised by Jesse Baines, and you killed him, so she's getting revenge, and yada, 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 and that's sort of the end of the game right there, or at the end of the book, um, which is interesting. I, I thought that that was sort of, you know, that, that was an interesting way to sort of wrap it up, because uh, I'm not going to call this ending empty and um, sort of disjointed. I mean, it, it wraps things up a, a little bit, I guess, but um, yeah, it... it it, it felt like it, it did lack a little bit of extra spice. Yeah, right that was there. coming out of nowhere. We, I, it would have been nice to know why she was doing what she was doing. Yeah, there was really no no exploration of morality. No, she was a bad seed the... from the start, and she continued to yeah. be a bad seed until the end, until she got shot. Yeah, not much character development. Um, yeah, she was doing crack, or she was selling coke, or something. They don't even say what she was doing with it, either. Yeah, right? I, I yeah. was ho I was um, hoping for a little bit more closure as well. the The ending for this one is a little lackluster. Yeah, a little bit lackluster. Yeah, and, and especially sadly, compared to like the movie like ending of Police Quest Two, which was kind of right. awesome. Going to another town well, and getting going to the sewers and stuff that was awesome. It's true. Police Quest Two uh, is probably the pinnacle of the Police Quest series, right? Like, there is just a lot more that was going on in that one and they were a lot more sort of uh, planning on making it a, a more of a sort of buddy cop movie kind of thing even though Ke or, uh, Keith was, was still kind of useless there but uh, yeah like and it's it's kind of unfortunate that the, that Jim Walls went out on this one and on this ending as well like this is this is the end of Sunny Bonds there's no more Sunny Bonds uh, in, at all there are, there is another police quest which we will be doing soon. Right. Um, yeah, Police Quest 4 open season, or just Police Quest open season, was not made by Jim Walls, but instead uh, Daryl F. Gates, whose name you may have seen on the uh, Winners Don't Use Drugs uh, screens on arcades. Oh, yeah. Or uh, his name is also behind the uh, Dare... Um, uh, campaign and the Rodney King riots and the Rodney King riots. Yes, I was leading up to that one. So yeah, he was a big anti-drug guy, and he was also a big anti-black guy. 
Uh. Yeah, Daryl Gates is also the man who was behind, or who who was who had the back of the police officers that that beat up Rodney King. So it, I'm 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 gonna warn you now, and we'll probably warn you again at the beginning of the series that this the next game in the Police Quest series was written by that that guy. So, or at least consulted by that guy. I think we're gonna we're gonna do it for completionist sake, but uh, we are we are gonna go through it, and I mean it has something to offer. It is an interesting game. It's um it has voiceover, so we don't get to enjoy Matt's uh, character. That's a shame. That makes me sad. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's it's about as awful as you're gonna expect because it's all rotoscoped, but not like Police Quest Three was rotoscoped. Um. It's an experience. It's it's worth having the experience uh, you know, under your belt. Uh, it's going to be a long series as well because it's a particularly long game. But before we do that, instead of going right into open season, we're going to follow Jim Walls away from Sierra Online to a company called Tsunami, where he worked after he left Sierra Online to make another game called blue force and this that's the spiritual successor to this you would say yes yes? is the spiritual successor to the police quest original trilogy basically and um there there are some theories that it also wraps up the story of sunny and marie well i have never even i don't know anything about this so i'm really looking forward to seeing it so i hope you guys join us next time for sure for Blue Force. Yes, it's called Sierra Saturday, but I think that this one still fits the bill. And I hope that you agree. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, and look, the idea is we're going to do all the Sierra games. We just are. But occasionally, oh, yeah. where one like this fits in, we're going to do it. So, yeah, join absolutely. us. It belongs in the Police Quest run. Absolutely. absolutely. It is Police Quest three and a half. Besides, you just can't have a police game without me, Jimothy mm-hmm. Walls. <laughs> Jimothy. <laughs> Jimothy. Nicely done. Okay, guys, that's all that we have for today. Thank you very much for joining us. I hope that you enjoyed Police Quest 3, and I also hope very much that you will join us for Blue Force coming up next time. All right, everybody. Take it easy. Thanks for joining us. Remember, we love you with all of our hearts. All of our cold, tiny black hearts. My cock is disappointing, and I'm still fucking pissed. I can't even tell you. I, I can't even tell you guys how many times you saw my cock over the game. You just don't remember. It's erased from your mind. <laughs> it's that disappointing. It's that disappointing. Don't worry, Sonny. Yeah, uh, I liked it. <laughs> I think. <laughs>